The 10 News Weather Authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. Good evening, everybody. I'm meteorologist Edward Shaw. It was a cool and breezy day today, and we're going to see much of the same as we head later on into tomorrow as well. Really cold, though, in the morning. Going to have temperatures approach that freezing temperature of 32 degrees. But then as we look ahead further into the weekend, Friday and Saturday and Sunday, temps are going to return to about average, thinking in the 70s for the most part. But again, cooler temperatures for the next couple days at least. Radar showing some of those showers that have been moving through parts of the New River Valley and south side slowly fizzling out later on and continuing to fizzle out as we head throughout the evening. But while we were getting rain, Parts of West Virginia were getting snow quite a bit up in parts of Canaan Valley, way up into parts of West Virginia. They had overnight temperatures and low temperatures getting to the 30 degree margin across the area. Compare that to Virginia Tech's turf gr grass center station getting to 41. So definitely a difference in temperature further up to the north in the valley and some of those higher elevations. As always, you can always check that out on Virginia Tech Meteorology's Facebook page. But as for us later on tonight, we're going to get down to the mid to low 30s. 34 in Blacksburg, 38 in Roanoke, 38 in Bedford, 40 in Alta Vista, 41 in Danville, and 33 in Hot Springs. We're going to heat up tomorrow just a little bit, but it's not going to be until the late afternoon tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, though, we do have several freeze warnings that have been in effect and will continue to be in effect until about 10 a.m. tomorrow, just given those really cold overnight temperatures into the sub freezing level, thinking parts of the New River Valley and up in the Highlands regions for that. Your 10 to 10 forecast for tomorrow, partly cloudy skies throughout most of the day. Temperatures maxing out in the mid 50s, but overall a pretty nice day, even though it will be a little chilly throughout the day. High temperatures 56 in Roanoke, 50 in Blacksburg, 57 in Alta Vista, 59 in Danville, and 46 in Hot Springs. So overall, again, another cool day tomorrow, but then we'll heat up later on as we head into later into the week. 59 Thursday, and you can see where we have that cooler than average air within the area, but then we get up to about average within a degree or two on Friday, 67 degrees, and back up into the 70 degree mark by Saturday, and that looks to be like it's going to stay consistently within the low 70s heading into next week as well. So overall, plenty of sunshine and a little bit more consistent with the temperatures next week. Sunny skies for the rest of this week, though. And again, take a look at those low temperatures in the Roanoke Valley and each of our four zones in your four zone forecast. Getting down into the 30s across most of the region, but then temperatures in the mid 70s by this weekend.